self-determination. And there it is, baby! Let's go! We got him! It's about time, okay? We got both of them in one video. This is why you watch the entire video, because you never know what's going to happen. Oh, 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 oh! <laughs> what is this box right now? What? Oh, my God, bro! Oh, my God, bro! What is happening right now? This does not happen. Back in 2016, during the height of the Pokemon Go craze, Pokemon decided to release a set of Pokemon cards that truly brought us back to those nostalgic roots. And the set I'm talking about, of course, is going to be X and Y Evolutions. We have to see how many Charizards we get in today's video. There's five in the set. Let's see how many of those we can get. So join me today as we open an $800 X and Y Evolutions booster box straight from a $5,000 factory case in the year 2023. <laughs> I really can't believe it, but this set is somehow seven years old. I remember the day this was released, the first time I opened it up. It was such an experience, and it really brought me back into modern Pokemon cards. I mean, this box right here used to cost $90, and now today it's going for around 800 bucks. Is the box actually worth $800? Is this thing worth opening up in the year 2023? Well, we're going to find that out right now. And before we do that, like always, I want to continue giving back to you guys. So I'm going to be giving away an entire booster box of Paldea Bob. If you'd like to enter the giveaway, all I have to do is number one, smash the like button. Number two, make sure you subscribe to the channel with notifications on. And then number three, leave a comment down below in the comment section. I will say one thing, though. They did our boy Blastoise dirty because they did not have the original Blastoise Hollow in this set. Um, I, I just don't know why they did. I, I don't know. I don't know, they just didn't, but we did get a, a lot of really cool Blastoise cards in this set, and I'm hoping we can pull a ton of really cool cards out of this box. We're kind of going to need to, because honestly, it probably doesn't make a ton of sense to open up this set uh, seven years later for the cost of $800, but here's our four-pack artworks. All right, so let's pop the top on this thing, and let's get this opening going. And yeah, just so you guys know, the most expensive card in PSA 10 is... I mean, to no one's surprise, the Charizard Hollow, the classic. But it's really hard to grade a 10 on that thing. So let's see if we can get some bangers out of here. Our first booster pack of 2016 Evolutions. Let me know if you guys have opened this setup back in the day. I don't know which way the code cards are going to be facing. Oh, it's that way. All right. So the cool thing is, even with green code cards in this set, you could still get bangers. You can get Secret Rage. You can get Reverse uh, Hollows. They can even get Break Cards. So it's uh, like any pack of Evolutions can have pulls in it. We got Kakuna Matata Reverse. Electro non hollow. All right, pack number one of 36. Now remember, every pack technically is going to have something because this, even the reverses in this set are actually pretty like significant value. I mean, so, like a lot of them, depending on which card it is. There we go. We got a secret rare on our second pack. The Alolan Executor. That's a throwback right there. Uh, we got a Poliwag, the classic Pikachu, the classic Ponyta, Nidoran. So this is like the OG basic cards, but changes up sat stats and some different types. We got Vulpix. We got the Nidoran Reverse. And we got a Mew Hollow, one of the best Hollows in this set. The crazy thing about this is that actually we didn't get Mew in the English release of base set. So they decided to put it in the XY Evolution set. And it was such a cool bonus to get. I, I love this card, man. This box is pretty good. This is actually a pretty clean card, guys. And yeah, honestly, if Mew was in the original base set, that would probably be my favorite holo card um, that you could get in the set. So let's see here. We got that. We're going to go three from the back to the front. I mean, it would definitely be a top three card for me. De Evolution Spray. Start off. That used to be a, a rare in base set. You used to get trolled by De Evolution Sprays back in the day. Honestly, that's the worst you can get as a trainer card in base set as a rare. But... Oh, we got a Raichu, Rare Reverse, nice. All right, let's see what else, let's see what else. The Mewtwo, dude, they didn't put Mewtwo as a hollow in the actual booster box. You can only get that, the Cracked Ice version in the theme deck. That's probably the best non hollow Rare that you can get, though. It's actually going really good so far. Um, no EXs yet, no Full Arts yet, but let me know what you guys think of Evolutions. I'm gonna get some bangers right now. Oh, dude, I forgot that the code card's facing the other way. All right, so probably nothing in the Rare slot, but could get some nice reverse card let's see it could be you could get a charizard in the reverse slot growlith oh dude i was so glad i thought it was gonna be a Charizard <laughs> for a split second i thought it was it arcanine and the farfetched i'm not liking these rare non hollows though they're pretty off center i don't know what's going on with that but what i do know is uh if you guys saw in the intro this was straight from a case so if you guys don't know booster boxes come in factory cases with six boxes in it um and yeah that's how they ship them out so it's cool if you see a factory case thing, which it just helps with like authentication and stuff like that, especially if you get it straight from a distributor. Got Charmeleon. 
So yeah, we got Doduo, Staryu, Seal, Charmander, Magnemite. And we got our first break card. It's going to be the Starmie break with the Break Star attack into a Doug Trio. All right, let me know what you guys think of break cards. Some people love them. Some people hate them. Some people are in the middle. I don't know. Let me know what you think. Some people just don't even care. I don't know. They're interesting. I'll say that. They're definitely interesting. The Pokemon are definitely, they're like gold and everything. But yeah. All right. So let's see if we get some big hitters. Of course, I'm going to get the full art Dragonite, full art uh, Mewtwo, Charizard, all that good stuff. Give me all the good stuff. The Blastoise. We got Growlithe Reverse to go with the uh, Arcanine Reverse. And we do get the Blastoise. Mega Blastoise EX pull. Dude, I forgot how fun Evolutions is to open because, like, you get so many pulls, it's actually crazy. Like, yeah, the box is really expensive, but there is also one thing that you do get to look forward to with Evolutions is that the pull rate is pretty crazy. Like, to have it where almost every pack you're probably likely to get at least something is pretty wild. Um, I think a lot of it has to do with those reverse cards, to be honest with you. Um, some of them are pretty cool to get. Super Potion, Ghastly, but this is like, if you want to open a base set, well, it used to be really cheap to open this set up for so many years. Um, then like 2021 and yeah, like the end of 2020s, things started getting wild. Tangula, Ponyta, we got a Metapod Reverse and a Starmie. It was weird. It kind of just like woke up one day and I was like, oh, okay. Evolutions is, uh, it's like $500 a box or it like went to three all of a sudden. Then it went to five. Then it went to eight. Then it went to like a thousand. Right now I think it's around like 750 to 800. So it came down a little bit, but it's been, it has, it's been at that for a long time now. Probably like a year or two, honestly. Ghastly Sancho, we got a Machoke Reverse and an Arcana. Yeah, it looks like all of our rare uh, non hollows unfortunately, are pretty off-center. All right, guys, let's make the push for our first Charizard pull today. Or even our first uh, full art. See if we can do it. All right, make sure you guys grab these code cards. It's pretty good. I don't know. The code cards are probably worth a decent chunk of change. Actually, I'm going to check. I'm, I'm kind of curious. Um, if you guys don't know, I give away all the code cards. Uh, I mean, I feel like it's kind of like a standard thing for Pokemon YouTubers anyway, but eh, either way, it's, it's cool because you guys can grab those code cards. Eradicate. All right. So yeah, it's, it's still interesting to me that the regular Charizard Hollow is worth more than like the Mega Charizard Full Art, the Mega Charizard EX, like all that stuff. Get a good code card. All right. There's going to be something good on this one. Let's go Evolutions. Bring us back to 2016. Nidoran, we got Poliwag. Man, those were the days. Hitmonchan, reverse rare. And in, we got our first full art. It's going to be Misty's Determination. All right, check that card out up close. Let me know what you guys think. It looks pretty solid. Such a cool throwback to Gen 1. We got Misty right there, the gym leader. I'm going to show you. These are my three favorite pulls so far. The Mew Hollow, the Mega Blastoise EX, and the full art Misty's Determination that we just pulled. All right, let's keep going. It's super risky to open up something like this. You never know what you're going to get. Uh, but it's Evolutions. And I kind of, to be honest with you, I like to open up a box of evolutions once a year, just kind of just to like take a step back and um, I don't know, get a little like a little bit of nostalgia, you know what I mean? Just like where it's all started and everything. Probably we've got Magikarp Reverse and we got a Magneton Hollow. That's actually really solid. This card's like $500 in a PSA 10 because it's one of the toughest to grade. Uh, this one and Chansey are like some of the toughest cards to get a 10 in because you could get so many print lines. It's crazy. All right. Seven years ago, Evolutions released. Seven years ago. Before you know, it'll be 10 years. And I'll be like, what is happening? How is that even possible? Because I, I don't know. I just 2016 was a really cool year for me with Pokemon. Like I was really, really just like really getting into it, like really getting serious about it, really just having fun. And it was like those earlier days of getting back in that are like super nostalgic for me now. Onyx Reverse! And we got a Pidgeot EX. Alright, we'll take another EX. That's us, uh, that's our second EX today, right? Not bad, not bad. Let's see how many Charizards we could get in today's video. So far, we haven't gotten any, but there are a lot in the set. Uh, how many are there? There's the Charizard Hollow, Charizard Reverse, Mega Charizard EX, Charizard EX, Full Art Charizard. I think it's like five, maybe? Something like that? We'll see. But yeah, with five different ones, I mean, we got to have a shot, right? Poliwhirl Reverse and an Electrode. Yeah, I think that's correct. I think it's five. There are other ones, like pre-release ones, stuff like that. Um, but yeah, we're just counting the ones that you can get in an actual booster box here. We got to be able to get, hopefully, at least a couple today. That would be nice. I mean, dude, a Full Art or the Charizard Hollow would be sick. Drowsy, we got Caterpie Reverse. Oh, the Clefairy. Almost forgot they changed the type on this one, and this is in the set. Nice. Okay. That one's definitely a lot different than the OG one. Clefairy. At least it's not Mr. Mime in this set, you know? Am I right? I was thinking they were going to do, like, sort of something like this, but with uh, Jungle 
for like fossil or maybe both of them together for the 25th anniversary but um yeah that, that never happened it would have been like kind of like evolutions but just moving on a little further but yes yeah, yeah, they didn't they did celebrations which is actually really cool magneton reverse dugong so we got the magneton hollow and the magneton reverse actually getting a lot of rare reverses is pretty cool all right, we're almost halfway through this box. The packs of evolu the, for evolutions, they just fall apart so easily for some reason. So a lot of X and Y packs were like that. And, like, then Sun and Moon stuff was, like, the packs got a little bit, like, thicker. And, like, now with Charlotte and Violet, dude, they're, like, kind of tough to open up, to be honest with you. They're, like, triple, like, the thickness of these packs. Dugong! He draw the classic. This is, like, the worst to get ever. Give me something good out of one of these last two ones on the left side here, please. I came here to pull a couple Charizards today. As well as some nice full art stuff like that. So come on, what else can we do here? All right, we're we're back into the uh, with the three from the back to the front era of Pokemon cards. Ghastly, oh dude, come on. Left side, honestly, pretty solid. I mean, it wasn't bad at all. Probably could it could have been better, you know what I mean? But it was still pretty. It was solid. It is evolutions though. I mean, you get you get a lot of stuff, right? <laughs> I think you do. I mean, especially if you're comparing it to like. Uh, like some of those Sun and Moon sets, early Sun and Moon sets. Yeah, Star You, Tangela, Magmar Reverse. Ooh, Nido King, solid pull on the hollow. Is it just me or these hollows look like really clean today? Either that or my camera is like working overtime. Cause I don't know, I feel like the quality right now is looking like really good on my screen. Maybe it's a lighting, maybe it's, I don't, I don't know. And I still use like a super old iPhone for this one, by the way, if you guys are curious. I literally use an iPhone. At this point, this iPhone is probably like six years old at least. I don't even know. I don't even know which one it is, but it's like super old. But that's my it's my go-to. You know what I mean? I've had it since the beginning, and uh, I still use it. It just works. I don't know. It just works good. Well, good enough for me. So, you know what I mean? You probably like I have no idea what you're talking about. Just open the packs. Okay, I'll do that. Magnemite, Misty's determination. And there it is, baby. Let's go. Oh my God! The start of the right side. Yo, we got him. We got him. We got him. We got him. Yo, that is. There is no guarantee you're gonna get this, but we got it. Check that out up close. This right here is the number one valued card in the set. It's the OG Charizard, the king. I mean, it's hard to beat this, even with other cards that are in the set, even with other Charizards that are honestly probably tougher to pull. This one still makes it just because of that classic Charizard that we we grew up with back in the day. It never gets old opening up an Evolutions box and getting lucky enough to get the OG King himself out of it. Like, that's no guarantee. Super lucky on that one. I didn't know if it was going to happen. I, I thought it was not super likely to happen, but it happened. We got one so far. All right, let's put that on the board. One Charizard. Let's see if we get to ooh, ooh, Charmeleon right directly after that. Let's see if we can uh, continue. We got Sandshrew and a Beedrill again, bro. Get out of here. That's like the mime of the set right there. That or one of the trainers. I'm feeling lucky now. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. That was a good thing. The good card to get. Good thing. Good card to get. Um, now we got to work on getting some of these EXs and full arts. And even some really nice reverses you can get out here too, honestly. Switch, Machoke. I want a Pikachu reverse. I always try to get a Pikachu reverse. Starmie break again? Did we, didn't that, did we get Starmie break? How do we double up on a break card? Okay. And then, uh, yo, okay, man. This is the mime of this box. Yeah, it's kind of uh, surprising to double up on a break card. It's a bunch of different ones. I would have thought we would have got a different one. All right. And actually, haven't been pulling too many secret rares. For whatever reason, sometimes I get really, like, a lot of secret rares and evolutions. And other times, I barely get any or none. Today, we got one. But, yeah, I haven't seen many, which is kind of weird sometimes. Porygon. Bro, okay, the Farfetch 2. All right, Porygon, get in there. Come on. There we go. I'm not, I mean, like, I, I just, I have fun going back to Evolutions once in a while. Like, it's also a set that we used to open up back in the day on streams. Like, if you guys remember those, like, big streams that we used to do on the channel where we were opening up tons and tons of, tons of packs. Like, thousands of packs. I pretty much did that every day for a while. It was so much fun. But, uh, yeah, I had to, like, kind of stop doing that as much because I was, like, we were like 10 hour streams like, all the time and it was a lot it was a lot of fun though but um this is one of the sets that we opened up a lot we got the fire energy bro and then like into a duck trio we're definitely pretty low on full arts i think well, we only got one full art so far that's not too good ex's i think we got two i think it was two yeah kind of low on ex's 
Got pretty low on full arts. Let's even get another full art here. Magmar. Let's see if we get in this pack. Right here. This one right here. Full picks. We got Magic Card. Come on, baby. Ghastly Reverse. What's that? What's that? What's that? Mewtwo back again. All right. So we got. We still got a handful of packs left. We'll take it. We'll take it. We'll take it. I wonder if they're gonna do another set similar to Evolutions though one day. Like I don't know how you'd make it similar. I guess. Like I said, if they did like Jungle and Fossil and maybe Rocket all in one or something, would be kind of cool. Or maybe just Jungle and Fossil. The Evolution Spray as a reverse. And we got another EX. All right, we got the Venusaur. Now we just need Charizard because we got Blastoise, we got Venusaur. We need a Charizard EX. Actually, it was a Mega Blastoise EX, but you know what I mean. We just need a Charizard EX. All right, let's keep rolling here and see what else we can get. Evolutions. What do you got in store for us? Come on. Can I have some? Some of these cards are pretty tough to grade, too. That's the thing. A bunch of them are, especially the Hollows. No Duo! Zapdos! All right. That's a throwback right there. Honestly, the hollows in this set look shadowless. The way that they're just sort of like colored and brightness and stuff like that in contrast. They look like the shadow. They look shadowless. All right. We got, I uh, probably got like nine more packs left. So we still got a handful. I can still, we can still get a full art out of here. I think we still got a chance. I think we still got a chance to get a mega Charizard right now. Come on. Or Dragonite. Or me too. Or all three. Give me all three. Diglett. Switch, switch into a star. All right, this is fun though, but I'm I need another full art now at this point. One in a box seems pretty low to me, so I would honest. Oh no, was that a green? That was a green one. Oh, no. All right, all right, all right, all right. Brush it off. Keep going. Bruxish it off and keep going. Polywag and Arcanine. We only do Gen One memes today. Whoo! All right, let's kick it up here. Let's kick it up. No more. And uh, I haven't seen any more sticker rares. Oh, I just did that to myself. I just did that to myself on that one. Oh, but I called the secret rare. We got a surfer Pikachu. Misty's determination. Man, it's about time. About time. Okay. No, it's really about time, dude. We got both of them in one video. Oh my God. Are you kidding me right now? This is wild. Hold up. Hold up. All right, all right, all right. Oh, that's really, that's actually really good for an evolutions box. Check this out. Did not think this was going to happen today. Did re Really did not think this was going to happen today, guys. What do you think? That's pretty lucky, if you ask me. And we had the Surfer Pikachu in there. That's what I'm talking about. That, you know, green code card. Remember this. Green code card evolutions. It ain't over yet. No, it ain't over. Mm -mm. It's definitely not over when you get a green code card in evolutions. That's the beauty of evolutions. That's the one. Bro, we're getting all the secret rares now. Flying Pikachu, Surfing Pikachu. We got um, Alolan Executor. We got Tangela. Oh, look at that card. Dude, look how that card's cut behind it. Cut's so weird. What is it? What is it? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> what? Oh, my God. Dude, what? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What is this box? What is this box right now? What is this box right now? Oh my god! Dude, are you kidding me right now? <laughs> what is this turning into? Three now! Three now! Oh my god, dude! The other best Charizard to make a Charizard EX full art! Alright, we somehow... We got three just like that. Wait, I wasn't even paying attention. Was that the pack right after the Charizard? That we... The, the reverse Charizard? And every Charizard has had a secret rare. So we got Flying Pikachu. Great card. This is going... Like, this is going from a pretty decent box to... A really good box uh, within the span of like two packs towards the end of this thing. Honestly, really like, yeah, okay. We're going to get every secret rare. I think we're only missing one now. I think we just need Imokuni's Do Duo. Bro, let's go. We went from no, no secret rares or one to like all of them. All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, one, two, three, four, five more booster packs of evolutions. We have three of the five Charizards that you can get in the set. Somehow pulling in like 60% of these uh, of the Charizards. Like I don't know how, but we do. We did. We're doing it. Something's happening. Something else might happen too. Ooh, nice tails break card. Okay, I'll take that over the Starmie. All right, all right, all right. We only need two more Charizards today. Two more, baby. Let's go. All right. Folk, I'm a little bit more focused right now. So I'm trying to think of what would happen if we got every Charizard in the set in one box. That would be pretty wild. Oh, my God, bro. Oh, my God, bro. What is happening right now? 
no, 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 no. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god. This doesn't not happen. This does not happen. I don't think I've ever seen anybody open up an entire box of evolution to get every Charizard. But we, oh my god, we might actually do this right now. What is happening? Final three, I've never been so on the edge right now. <laughs> and the, like, I know, I'm actually like on the edge of my seat right now. I don't know what this box turned into, but it's nothing short of pure insanity. I have never seen somebody get every Charizard in one box. We got four of the five today. It's, it's, it's not like, I've opened boxes of these and pulled zero Charizards. It's crazy. Oh, I didn't get my Pikachu that I wanted. My Pikachu reverse. This is an insane box. This is an insane box. Get out of here. This is, seriously, this is an insane box right now. Man, like, seriously, the odds of getting every Charizard in one box, even four of the five, has to be so low. And we are just, like, somehow making that happen. I picked the right box out of that case. I don't know. Something was, it was speaking to me. I was like, pick me. And I was like, okay, I'm going to pick that box. Like, there were six boxes. I went for this one. I'm so glad I did. Because I could have went for a different one. Water energy. Farfetch. All right, listen, listen. We got the Charizard Hollow. We got the reverse Charizard Hollow. We got the Mega Charizard, and we got the Full Art Mega Charizard. All we need is the regular Charizard EX. That's the last one in the set. If we get it out of this last Mega Blastoise pack, we will have every single Charizard in the set. And a crazy booster box opening. This is what happens. Well, this is what happened with us when we opened Evolutions in the year 2023, seven years later. We should make this a yearly thing, because it's pretty much been a yearly thing at this point, I think. Uh, but here we go. We got Doduo, Pikachu, our last chance to get the final Charizard that we need out of one booster box. Every single Charizard. We got a reverse Zapdos in our final card. Can we do it? In three, two, one. Oh my god, bro! We got the Blast Lucy. That was so close! Oh my god! We got that was so close. It could have been it. Alright, an absolutely insane opening. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to smash the like button on your way out. If you want more content, click on one of the two videos at the top there. Hit that subscribe button as well. And as always, I hope you have a great day, and I will see you on the next one.